Yo, what is going on everyone? My name is Paradox and welcome back to part 4 of Horizon Zero Dawn. It has been a hot minute since I played this game and I probably don't even remember how to play, but I wanted to revive this series and try to complete it since Horizon Forbidden West is coming out soon. Now, if you haven't seen my progress up to this point, make sure to watch the previous videos on my channel, then come back here and enjoy the ride. Otherwise, let's get started. So if you'll remember from the last part, we have to help a woman named Alara find her brother Brom. And in order to do that, we have to go to his abandoned camp to see what happened. Hey, let's go. We got our first enemy. We'll warm up on this guy since it shouldn't be too hard. <laughs> yeah, boy. Boy, ain't no way, boy. Boy, ain't no way, boy. Bruh. I'm joking. I'm joking. This definitely did not go to plan. I just gotta be smart about this. Okay. I think this is it. This must be Bomb's camp. Better clear out those watchers. <laughs> yep, this is probably it. How do I throw a rock again? Oh. Slithering. Oh, watch out! Watch out! Watch out! Watch out! Watch out! <laughs> Easy clap. Another one. Blood, but no body. There's gotta be more to this. Looks like a few drops of blood lead away from the camp. Time to go Sherlock Holmes on this scene. Whose knife is this? Did someone attack Brom with it? Probably. Looks like more blood leading away from here. My question is, how did the Braves not find this stuff already? I mean, it seems pretty simple and straightforward, all things considered. There, a bucket. Did someone bring the blood to the camp? The trail of blood ends here. But whoever left it must have also left tracks. Wow. You know, rain or shine, this game is just exquisite looking. Ooh, alright, time for some stealth maybe. Coming down steady as a gun beat. I can get past these guys. Alright, I'm going for it. Uh, don't see me, don't see me, don't see me, please, please, please. Looks like we're clear. Fight! Alright then, let's go! <laughs> Bro, I can't see! Oh. Yeah, come on now, you can't take me down that easy. There's one thing we know about me. It's that I suck at stealth. That's twisted. I wonder if the blood from the camp came from this boar. If Brom did this, why does he want people to think he's dead? And why desecrate the shrine? Did my man make some bacon at least? So how did he see me there? What are those scrappers picking at? Right. I won't make the same mistake twice. Now I know how to take these guys. Frick! Alright, uh... <laughs> we're not fine. Nope. <laughs> Oh, that's 
how you make arrows. Well, that would have been useful to know. Wait, fire arrows? Looks like it was a watcher. Whatever I'm following made short work of it. Oops. If it's Brom, he definitely knows how to handle a spear. guy walk through the wall or something what's going on here oh someone loaded these supplies Brom was an outcast for a long time why take food and gear now it's the supplies from the cache why would they take them and just throw them away I will I'll, I'll kill myself what I'll the? kill myself before I hurt her I won't listen! Uh, uh, not until you promise. Oh, how did he even get up here? <laughs> I will. I'll, I'll kill myself. I'll kill myself before okay, I hurt her. Calm down, Bucko. You, you're not a spirit. What do you want? I want you to step away from the edge, Brom. No. Leave me alone. Can't you see I need time to think? I, how, how, how am I supposed to think when everybody is shouting at me? I'm not shouting. I know you're a good listener. So come listen to me, just as you would the others. They... they say not to listen. <laughs> but... Alara always said, never ignore a speaker. I can see. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I'll hear you out. That's better. Now tell me, what's troubling you? The spirits of the forgotten. Souls cursed by the All Mother. Their voices never let me be. They want me to do things. Hurt people. If I go back to the Nora, they might make me hurt Alara. And I. I'll kill myself before I let that happen. Do you have to listen to the spirits, Brom? They're speaking to me right now. Oh, is with me. They take care of me. Keep me company. Help me. Except when they scream. Like when that hunter knocked me down. Crush your skull with the rock, they said. Uh... And I did. Brom. Huh? You're alive. Where did she oh, come from? Mother be praised. I'm sorry I followed you, but I had to make sure he was all right. No, 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 no. Please, sister, I, I, I can't protect you. I need no protection from you, Brom. He fears these spirits that he hears will turn him against you. Unless your voice can quiet them? Yes, just as it was before. He only ever hurt someone once, and it was provoked. Right. I don't want to hurt you. But the Forgotten, their... their whispers, they... they fill my head with screams. Brom isn't ready to return to the Nora. But I don't think he'll hurt you, Alara. There's a place where I can stay. A cave on All Mother Mountain. I suppose you could visit me there, so long as I'm strong. You will be, Brom. I'll help you. Thank you, Aloy. I'll take care of him now. May you walk in all mother's eternal memory, and may the forgotten leave you be. Okay, goodbye. Good luck. Yep. She's dead. Alright. Now that we've found Brom, uh, we can start gearing up for the embrace. And one thing we can do is get that trip caster. But first, we gotta do some hunting. We're doing it right this time. No mercy! Headshot! Yeah, what's good, huh? I don't miss a shot, bro! Yo, we're cracked!
it was at this moment that he knew. He f***ed up. <laughs>
And I'm not going to shun you after the proving, okay? I'm just... I won't do it. I'm not about to pretend that you never raised me. Aloy, the law forbids all contact. It does, and I don't care. I know what duty means for you, Rost, but all tribal law has ever done for me is take things away. And that's not gonna happen again. Aloy, I must obey the law. And so you will. I knew you'd say that, so this is what we'll do. I'll come to you in secret. No one will see me, so I won't get in trouble. A and I know you won't talk to me because it's against the law, but I'll talk to you. It'll be my crime, not yours. You'll just listen. And that's how we'll handle this. You've put a lot of thought into this. I know. So you can stop worrying. It's handled. Yes. So it is. Still a while to go before dark. I guess I'll get some rest. Good idea. There'll be no time for sleep tonight. Opening a gate for an outcast? Some who are shunned reaped honor before disgrace. <sighs> so much for tribal law. I spoke to no one, and now we must both keep silent, for we are outside of the embrace. These are the true wilds, Aloy. With threats unlike any you have ever faced. That carcass? What sort of beast was that? The tribe calls it a sawtooth, and it's something new, something angry. Since they first started appearing ten years ago, they have killed many braves. Yeah. By the way, that awkward silence at the gate literally killed me, bruh. Why was it like that? What happened to it? A machine, that's what. What sort of machine does that? The sort of machine you're hunting now. Oh, I see. Oh, no, no. <laughs> oh, what the? <laughs> oh, look at the top of his head. All right, let's get down to business. Won't be much farther now. Why are we the only ones out here tonight? Why can't the tribe's braves hunt this machine? They did. The kills we passed are theirs. And tomorrow, they will hunt again. <laughs> they won't need to. This machine will be my kill. Or your death, if you're not careful. An entire lodge? Wrecked? By... Sawtooths? How many were there? I didn't bring you here to answer questions, Aloy. I brought you here to deal with that. Uh... for you to decide. This hunt is yours to make, Aloy. Yours alone. No matter what happens, I will not intervene. You understand? You are on your own. Okay, let's see. Where can I place my traps? Holy cow, he's gargantuan. 
mean, just listen to that breathing as well. I gotta be careful about this, bro. Please work, please work, please work, please work, please work, please work. Yes! This! Okay, he just tanked that. set up our next traps now. Honestly, if I just do this over and over again, we should be all right, I think. Out of ammo. I should switch weapons. Why did I bring you here? Not to answer questions. Aloy. Survival requires perfection. It was a test to hone my skills against a dangerous new machine. No. Follow. These are Nora hunting lands. They must be protected. If you hadn't destroyed the Sawtooth, how many braves might it have killed or injured tomorrow? The lesson lives within the question, Aloy. For years, you've trained to win the Proving, but only for yourself. As a brave, it will be your duty to fight for your tribe. My tribe? You said I wouldn't need them. But I never said the tribe wouldn't need you. The strength to stand alone, Aloy, is the strength to make a stand. To serve a purpose greater than yourself. That is the lesson you must learn. And remember it. After the proving. And after I'm gone. We're finished here. Follow. Dawn has passed. This will be your last day in the embrace as an outcast. Use the time to set your mind on the challenges before you. When it is time for you to go to Mother's heart, I'll be waiting for you along the way. I'll go back to the cabin with you. I'm not heading there just yet. I have other plans. Oh. 
Such as? I'll be waiting for you when it is time. I'll see you at Mother's Heart then. You will. Alright y'all, this is going to be the end of part 4. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to leave a like. I'll be posting this series more consistently, so if you want to see more from me in the future, make sure to hit that subscribe button. I also stream on YouTube every week, so if you enjoy that type of content, make sure to tune in whenever I go live. Other than that, have a great rest of your day. I'll see you in the next one. Take care.